This is a uh, cruise, uh, long range cruise at 375 pounds an hour in the super van at 3,000 feet. We're indicating a combined about 150 knots indicated. And we are truing air out at 157 knots on a fuel flow of 375 pounds an hour at 60% uh, torque and an EGT of 497. Okay, this is a Superman 3,000 foot max uh, cruise speed. We're actually uh, at 90, about, let me get it up a little bit here. Actually, it dropped off with just a little bit. So we're at uh, about 93% torque running the already at red line, 94%. So uh, right now we got, uh, what do you have for an indicated? I'm 175, or 176. Yeah, I'm at uh, airspeed, Ross? Yeah. Yeah, 176. Okay, so we got, I will say 175, that 3,000 feet, 13 Celsius, are heading at 160, it's giving us a true airspeed of 183 on a fuel flow of 480 pounds an hour. Torque is 94, and the EGT is 573. And now we're, we're at... Uh, Dash 42, powered here at, at, uh, at uh, 3,000 feet, 9 degrees Celsius. Uh, indicated airspeed is showing about, is it bumping up just a little bit? Yeah, call 138. Okay, we'll go 138. So we're indicating uh, 138 knots and we have a true airspeed of 52, 152 knots on 375 pounds an hour and 1440 on the torque and 16, 640, 614. 614 on the ITT. So this is a long range cruise again at 375 pounds an hour. All right, now we're in the uh, Dash 42 powered uh, caravan and we're at a 3,000 foot maximum continuous cruise uh, and we're uh, plus nine degrees Celsius, and we're in the, it's a it's a little turbulent, so uh, we're going to take an average. We're averaging showing about 165 knots to be fair right now. Uh, it's a little bit low right now, but the turbulence I think is what's killing it. So we're say 165 knots indicated. We've got uh, a true airspeed of 181 knots and a fuel flow of 495 pounds an hour Approach and a torque of uh, 2230 286, go ahead yep. and what's your IGT? We have IGT is 700 right, we're at, now we're at uh, Supervan, 6,000 feet a long range cruise, 375 pounds an hour uh, we're in, we're indicating about 150, let's go 154, okay, on there, which would be about split the difference there. 154 indicated, and we're truing out at 169 knots true, and the fuel flow is 378 with 66% torque and 527 on the EGT. Uh, in the super van, we're at 6,000 feet, we're doing a max cruise. Uh, we just got the power all the way up. We're going to go a little bit. We're right at red line right now. Uh, 175. 
Uh, yeah, we're indicating 175 knots. And, uh, and oh, let me get the altitude correct here. And I got 6,000 feet. 6,000. Okay, so we're at 175 indicated. And uh, what's the OAT again? You said it was uh, 10 degrees? 10 degrees. Really? Yep, okay, 10 degrees Celsius. Yeah, maybe nine. Okay, so we're showing 10 degrees Celsius, indicating 175. We're truing out at 192. And we're at a fuel flow of 482 pounds an hour, 481. We're 100% torque. And the EGT is 613. All right, we're now at 6,000 6, feet. We got an OAT of 6 degrees Celsius. Uh, we're doing a long-range cruise at 375 pounds an hour. Or 300. It's showing 380 right now. Uh, and we got an indicated airspeed of 139, and a true airspeed of 152 at a torque value uh, 1560 and let's go 1560 with an ITT of 646. All right, this is uh, 6,000 foot max cruise uh, and we're showing, uh, what do you got over there? 160. 160 knots indicated. Yep. And we're at max torque. Um, we're, and we're showing 171 true. Oh, wait a second. Let me get the uh, temp correct. I got to have a positive. There we go. Enter. Okay, so we're at 160 indicated. We got a true airspeed of 174 and a fuel flow of 480 pounds an hour. And the torque is 2230. About 20. Yeah, 2230, with an ITT of 725, maybe? Uh, I'd call it 7, yeah. It was, it was, it was 725, yeah. so. Rolling. All right, here we go. So we're at, two th we're at 12,000 feet in the Supervan. We're doing a, uh, a long-range cruise at about 376 pounds an hour. We're, we're indicating... Uh, let's see. Mine's bumping around now. Let's, let's give it just a second. Back to 153, it was at steady at 157. Yeah, I'm showing 150 now. It's coming back up. Let's yeah, one, it's about 152 over here. Uh, all right, I'm back to 155. Well, let's set it at 154 then. That's at 156. Half mile, final 57. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty average. Let's leave it at 155. 155. Yeah. Okay, so 155 is an average. I'm 157, you're 153? Yep. Okay. So we're at 155 indicated. It's a true and out at uh, 187 true on 376 pounds an hour and 75% torque with an EGT of 594. And we're at 12,000 feet on a super van, zero degrees Celsius. Indication, or indicated airspeed was, you said, 162, and true airspeed is 195 knots true on a fuel flow of 430 with a torque of 91% and an EGT of 650. Okay. All right, we're doing a 12,000 foot uh, cruise again, and now we've reduced the power to 375 pounds an hour just for like a longer range cruise. Um, right now we're showing uh, 140, 140? Yep. 140 knots indicated. So we got 140 knots indicated. We got a true airspeed of 167 with a fuel flow of 375 pounds an hour and at a torque value of 1740 and an ITT of basically 700. All right, so we're going, right now we're at 12,000 feet. We're indicating 156. We're truing 186. A fuel flow of 450, 450 pounds an hour, at a torque of 22, or 2220. Yeah, 2230 is max. I'll get it back there. And our, uh, 
Well, you're at your ITT almost limit. Yep. 765, 767. This thing's all falling all over the place. Yeah, I think it's a piece of it.